Hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome back to Holy Potatoes Weapon Shop. What the... Uh... Oh, okay, there we go. It's just doing a cutaway. So, a couple of things I've learned, thank you to the comments. First and foremost, I've learned that you can actually make multiple weapons at a time. Or, not exactly multiple weapons at a time. You can make, uh... You can make... Uh, let's see. What combinations have I not researched yet? Send Bulk Hogan off to do that one? The thing is, I'm, I'm trying to decide... Wait, is this how we make a wand? No, this is how we make fancy equipment. Still no wand. Uh, but you, you can actually make three weapons and then go sell them to save time. That actually makes a lot of sense. Let's go to the world map. So let's explore. I want to say we've got to explore here. I'm going I'm to send some people out. So we're going to have Bulk Hogan do research. Which honestly doesn't make a whole lot of sense. I, I feel like uh, Bulk Hogan should do nothing but training, and only training at all times. Uh, but that's that's silly. So let's see what kind of bow we can make. Actually, we should select the arrowhead. Okay, we've got that one already, we've got that already. We don't have this one. Uh, Bulk Hogan it is. Smith? Oh, I see. So this the uh, skill of the smith just makes it faster. Doesn't make it anything else. Okay, that's easy enough. And let's send... Uh, let's send the wizard not on vacation. We're gonna send him out to train because he's actually catching up, but he also started with a lower level class than anybody else. Uh, maybe not there. What about here? Most amount of experience is there? Yeah. All right. So we're, we're gonna be training at the Winter New Olympics with Volander Smith. Uh, gonna cost me a thousand. We'll be okay. Okay. And he'll just hang out for a bit. So let's go to double time. I feel like triple time's just a little bit fast. I love the weather report. Can't type frozen fingers. That's adorable. I, I love the fact that there is weather and seasons in this game. Oh, they're getting back. So she's got, did she get elemental rune? That might be what we need. All right, so let's hit continue. Uh, so she is currently a craftsman, which is speed. Okay, so let's go back down to regular speed. He's back. He gets some experience. Uh, he's currently a designer. That's weapons. Okay, so that means I think. Uh, please, please. There we go. We can finally make a. We can finally make a wand. Good. Unfortunately, we're running a little bit low on cash. So as soon as Bulk Hogan comes back, let's go straight up to triple time. What the? Okay, choice of fate. Uh. Small yellow bird with beak resembling thick lips is staring at a bunch of green pipes extending from above and below. The bird seems to be a species native to Vietnam. We can do this. New high score. Yes. Okay. So it's almost there. I mean, you know what? Let's actually, let's do a contract. One that doesn't require accuracy. So, in the hood. Need a hood, brother. Make it metal. Big bad wolf is going to have his last bite ever. Little red. Cute. Okay, so that's pure speed. So, in that case... Let's move him here. Okay, so we can now make the hunter's bow. And we're gonna put him on accuracy. Choice of fate. Uh, ask her if she's Edna Code. All right. So, a what? I didn't have enough. I'm seventy-two short. That's okay. We we've got this in the bag. So we're in negative 72. So I, I guess it was just a little bit enough to stay out of the negatives. Okay. So in that case, let's uh, let's do some let's do some basic contracts just to get our cash back. He's got a fair amount of accuracy bonus, so we'll work with him. Eventually, we'll get the ability to actually have multiple people on these. Oh, I'm actually a little bit concerned. We might not be able to complete this one. All right, hold on. Change Smith glass. Let's bring him back to a metal worker. That should help. Will it be enough? Not enough. Too little, too late. Oh, what? We extra had extra time? Oh, there must have been a, a one day thing in there. Okay, so there's some more money. Feed the dog. Dog is happy. Let's take a look at contracts again. All right. Speed is up. Yeah, we're just going to do speed for a second. So you go back on... 
You go back to an enchanter. Confirm. And you go back here. You, on the other hand... Your, your speed work is garbage. Your speed work... Is really bad. Unless I have on... If, unless I switch him to Craftsman. Alright, we'll just switch him like that. We need we need the pocket cash before we do anything else. Okay, good. We do actually have plenty of time on this one. Okay. I was I was worried that we'd run into uh run into like massive debt issues just because I was trying to be a little bit pushy. Actually, you know what while we're here? If we can do research, let's send in uh Recipeters. Cause we're not using his en enchanting skills anyway. Yeah, so I'm just gonna do contracts until uh Either contracts or basic weapons design. Uh, uh, pretty Elf offers you some magical bread to tide the long day ahead. He says one nibble is enough to fill any potato to, to the brim. Eat the whole thing! Oh, you're full of the brim. And keep having to get rid of it, if you know what we mean. Bull Kogan is slow. That's okay. We've got more than enough time to fin finish this contract. There's some cash. Okay, so I am not... I'm not in trouble anymore. Let's, let's switch him back. He can just stay Metal Worker. Okay. He'll go there. Contracts. Any of these do multiple. Uh, Keylessly kiting. Alright. We might as well move him there. This should be a very easy contract to finish. I can't imagine them failing this one. Motherfucker. Alright. Never mind. Uh, Lucky Horseshoe. They can do this. They get some amount of experience anyway every time. Uh, let's see. Love it. Uh, love it. Okay, a little potato boy comes up and asks you for love advice. A stallion must run. And it must run free. Or love as you would want to be loved. Horses! Yay! He nods, and the vision of a future Casanova flickers before your eyes. Oh, an amazing weapon, too. Yay! Lore, craft, speed. Uh, times 1.25, plus 13 for one day. Alright, wow. Yeah, we've got plenty of time to finish the Lucky Horseshoe. Okay, so I've been wasting my time just a little bit here, but that's that's fine. We can now forge the Apprentice Wand in our shop. So let's put him back on magic. Okay. Hey, uh... Less money, more EXP for selling to the marshes. Alrighty. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. You know, I just realized this one actually requires accuracy, and I totally forgot about it. We've got plenty of time, though. To get a 15 accuracy bonus? Yeah, no problem. Okay, how's this experience doing? I have no idea. And we finished that one. Okay, so now we've got money. Now we've got that. I haven't screwed myself, and we don't want to do research. Let's make a wand. So you can actually get new weapon types in this game. Good. That's what I've been looking forward to. And we've got more than enough magic dust for it. So, we want to go magic all in on this one. And do I spend the money for Portana? No, I've been I've been hurting my income by doing that. Alright. It's going to be a pretty low-level wand, honestly. Actually, you know what? Let's... Plonky, actually... There we go. Wait, why did I do that? Okay, your... Hmm. You go over here. I think you want magic and accuracy, not magic and just melee damage. I'm dumb. Alright, fine. Uh, I left a large tank with a giant fish in it. Let's feed it. Surprise death. Fish dies. Alright, and we can enchant it with some magic. Let's skip it. Let's just call it that for the time being. Alright, so this is a pretty shitty wand. Honestly. Oh well. That's that's not what I wanted to do. Oh well. You're you don't even belong there. You belong there, Volander goes there. Okay. Let's forge something else. Uh something that we can sell to people. New bow. Really? I haven't made that yet. Alright, let's let's just go with the basics right now. And let's just have Bulk Bogan do it. Because I think it gets a extra EXP. I have no idea. I want to take a look at things. So, weapon growth. Oh, the expected ones. I really should probably have paid attention to, like, what stats are primary. But I, I guess you can kind of look 
based on each one of them. Okay. Anyway, uh, let's go up to triple time. Let's see, save him by chasing off the attackers, and the uh, the kid actually gives us 500 starch this time around. Good. Okay. And we're... Well, let's just enchant it with accuracy. I've got a lot of these. And I can go get more. Fairly easily, too. Okay. I, I'll bother naming them again when I'm actually streaming these. I did not have the time to record this week. So I've been kind of rushing about. Okay. So let's let's actually go full hog on this one. Go on, Stevie Flounder. You've got the cash. Ooh, look at those stats. Okay, so we want attack and speed. So let's send you with your bonus attack. You you Oh wait, no. She's the speed person. There we go. Let's just max the two stats and see what happens. Add the enchantment. Okay, prefix added vicious. Okay, I haven't had that happen before. Okay, so let's send everybody back to where they belong. You, you're you're on accuracy. You're there. That's where I selected the right person. Okay, let's go to the world map. Let's sell sell our weapons, and we're selling them to the Tower of Ripier. Yes. Yeah, because we want to sell it to uh, Elrado Mageborn, uh, the wand at least. Okay, so let's bring... We've got a, a rogue. He wants a dagger. Okay, so we're not going to bring the longbow. We're going to send the vicious axe along too, because we can sell it to Grohl uh, for some extra cash. All right. Select a smith. Let's send Russet Peters. All right, next up, we're going to send her... We're going to send her exploring, because we need a lot more mage, mage parts, I think. Okay, next up... Do we have any more... No, we don't have any more wizardy stuff. Okay, fine. So I've already researched. Take a look at bows. Yeah, okay, so I've already researched pretty much all of these. Oh, hey, I haven't researched this one. Might as well get the crazy looking knife. And we've got a fair amount of cash. Okay, so I think at this point, I'm going to want to start um, focusing on. Oh, shoot. They're already back. Uh, so he's. I'd love to s sell it to Harry Oakwan, but we've got to sell it to... Well, I guess the difference in price isn't that great. Okay. And then the axe. Whoa! They like this axe. Was it worth it? No. The, the price difference really wasn't that worth it. Except for to level him up by 12. Holy crap. Alright. And she's back with some more stuff. Good. Okay. More elemental runes. That's exactly what we need. Okay. So we put her on speed. Okay. So you go to the Tower of Rook Beer, we get a lot of money. Wow, the merchant bonus is handy. Oh, right. And Grohl really likes the axe. So let's put him there. Okay. Agent 46, which I didn't realize this at first. He's totally a reference to Hitman, and I just blanked on it because he had glasses. Anyway. Hey, Grognar. Knock, knock. Ooh, I love knock, knock jokes. Who's there? Ivan. Ivan who? Ivan, my cut of the profits. What? That's not funny at all. You owe me 2,000 starch this round. Time to cough up. Oh, all right. All right. Well, Agent 46, Agent 46. I presume you're here to give me my cut? How do you know? In my line of work, you always have to know. Where's the starch? He Snatch. Darn, he got me again. All, to better, all the better to do my job with, my dear. Now, let's see. Well, Grognar, congratulations. You've raised starch, uh, the starch I asked for. Yay, what do I do next? Oh, that's easy. Start getting ready for my next cut of the profits. All right, uh, let's see. So we're working on the fame part. He's working on that. Let's let's see if I can do a contract that does not involve... Uh, let's go all in on speed. Bulk Bogan can help out on this one. We should be totally fine. All right, so we can now make the Chris in our shop. Let's send Volander back. Uh, let's see. Golden apple. Eat the apple! And Russet Peters is faster for a day. That doesn't really help us that much, but okay. We might be running into a bit of trouble here. Let's boot, switch him back to a craftsman. Okay, area of event. Strange disease has 
Oh, strange sleeping disease has overcome the town. Everybody's asleep. Less money experience. Okay, good. We did just barely get it. Let's switch him back, metal worker. Confirm. Okay, and let's stop doing contracts for a little while. Let's just for forge some weapons. Okay, so we want to do... We want to do another wand. Uh, all into magic. Let's just have Russet Peters do it. And let's send Volander over here and her over here. Let's just pour all into the the two main stats that people seem to care about. Because wands want... Nope, they want speed. Okay, and a little bit late. Don't have anything else to boost. Let's just boost up speed with the enchantment. At some point, I'll get a magic enchantment along the way, but fine. Light. And we're going to call this one the, uh... The doohickey. Okay, so we finished the doohickey, which apparently speed was its primary stat. Let's put him back. I really wish it would actually default back to, like, a previous speed, or there's... Actually, is there keyboard shortcuts? Pan up, uh... There's no keyboard shortcuts for changing the speeds in this game. That's a little bit disappointing. Oh well, it's not the end of the world. So let's forge Let's forge another axe. Because that last guy loved the last one. Okay, and we're going to go... Uh, let's see, payday's arriving soon. That's fine. This time I'm actually paying attention. Volander Smith can work on that. Okay. So I think we've got this in bag. Let's just let's just default to times two speed. I think times three is just a little bit too fast to be manageable. Now let's think. Uh, we as long as I don't spend too much money, I can buy like one thing here. Might be a little bit much. That said, the wallpaper is tempting. Do we have anything here that I can get? Not from there. I think I have just enough for the wallpaper. Yeah, we've got enough. Okay, as long as I don't spend any more money, and I don't think we're gonna have to worry about that. And we're gonna give this one a vicious enchantment. Okay. Feed the dog, and... Let's forge another thing. So we, this time around, we want a dagger. Ooh, this is a pretty high-level dagger. Don't want to spend any money, so let's go speed. Have Lorecraft do it. Okay. So we want speed and damage. So let's just focus in on on those. I I don't actually know whether or not the like secondary stats are or the like tertiary stats are actually even remotely useful, but I like the idea of potentially just maxing these things out. How's everybody's level doing? So she's. Craftsman level 4, level 3, level 4. Okay, and speed's looking pretty good, but I've got I've still got a bunch of these acorns. Let's just keep boosting that. Okay, it's reasonable. It's not great, but it's reasonable. Okay, and let's send everybody back to their respective spots. I kind of wish you could save positions like in... um. Okay, uh, so let's go to the world map. We've got three things, right? Yes, Ooh, we've got more. I forgot about the bow. Well, either way. I've got three things to sell to the three different people here. All right, next up, you. Uh, sent a world map. Can I train you? How much would it cost to train? Too much. Okay, so why don't we, why don't we do ex exploration in multiple places? So bulk bogan and then lore craft. Let's see. Okay, so that'll give me some much much needed resources. And then Volander can just sit around. He's a level four designer. Okay. So this is this is the doohickey. So let's keep selling it to this guy. For a fair amount of money. Max him out. And then Dagger for him. Perfect. Okay, so that'll that'll be plenty of cash. Okay, so he's back. What do we get? Some sapphire, some rope, some wood. Okay, so exploration is actually a pretty good idea. Gives me a lot of the basics that I need along the way. Okay, let's keep him there. Our cash is fine. We're, we have yet to... Here we go. Look at this money coming in. 
What is this? Oh, he's depressed. Alright, note to self, send him on vacation. Then again, we've got the cash for it. So he really liked the axe. And everybody else was kind of okay about everything else. That's fine. So, now that we have money, if he's depressed, we need to send him on vacation. Oh, let's see, Pilsner Parade, New Village Comic Con, and Farmoloville. So that's five happiness. What's the difference? What's the difference between any of these? Oh, is it time? One day, eight hours. One day, three hours. 22 hours. I see. So that one's more expensive, but it saves a little bit of time. That's dumb. Let's go here. Okay, so he's depressed. See, I thought he had some kind of, like, weird badass thing going on. But the answer is no. Okay. So you know what? Why don't we... Why don't we send everybody on vacation? Might as well do it for morale. He, on the other hand, he's not going on vacation. So that's 70 EXP. That's 70 EXP. That's 40... Okay, we're sending him here. Not Volander. We're sending in Bulk Bogan. He's a little bit low level because I keep switching him out. And Volander will just sit there like like a good wizard. Okay. So things are actually... Things are working out fairly well here. I'd love to research some new wand types. That would be a good idea. Unfortunately, you can't leave the the thing completely unmanaged, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense because you'd think, well, you've got you've got the, the main character. Where is he? What is he doing in all of this? All right, so you've got some extra EXP. Uh, should be fun. Let's see if we have any good contracts with a minimal amount of stats. Keasley Kiting. Okay, so we're going to put him on speed for a second. I'll switch him over to damage. Oh, shoot. Okay, so he's back. Let's slow it down. She's back. She's elated. Let's put her on damage. We're gonna need it. Because apparently Volander is garbage. We don't finish the contract. Damn, Volander. You are bad. Oh, well. S salaries seem to be pretty okay, so let's put her back on speed. In there. Okay. So, I think, why don't we do research? Let's get us, let's get us a new wand. Why is it accuracy? I am just legitimately confused. Why is accuracy more interesting, interesting? Uh, or more important for the wand than, like, the magic stat. Weird. I had no idea. Alright. I guess let's send... Bul Bogan? No. No, we'll do research on the next track. Let let's forge some stuff. Okay, so I think doing the same set with the daggers and whatnot. So first and foremost, it doesn't seem like it's particularly important to do the higher end stuff. For the most part... Let's go with the, let's go with the kitchen knife. Now nah, I've got enough. I've got enough of pretty much everything. Let's make it, Chris. These things are worth a lot of money. Okay, and we'll just have Laura Craft do it. That's pretty good. Okay, because we want magic, really. All right. Who's got a fairly decent magic stat? He does. Strange. No idea why he would. Unless I accidentally switched him to the wrong class. No. I have no idea. Alright, well, let's just keep him there for a second. So we've got a fair amount of speed. Going magic and damage. Ignore accuracy. No clue. Alright, so people are leveling up. He's enchanter level 3. Uh, potato and armor burst in, claiming to be your descendant from the future. He's wearing a funky butterfly masquerade mask. He tells you to dodge to your left in 5 seconds. Dodge left! You got the direction wrong, and you find yourself hit by a foam gun dart. Somewhere, your future self loses a bet. What a dingus. Okay. So. Dagger's done. Uh, let's give it some speed. Let's make us another dagger. Not a, another dagger. Let's let's make us another... A wand? Yeah, we... 
I, I'm effectively switching between... Why? Actually, you know what I could do? Let's go Wand. It's magic and speed this time. So Vol Volander has fairly good speed. Let's go this way. And let's... Yep, magic. Have Russet Peters do it. That was garbage. Wow, Russet Peters. You are the worst mage. His magic is only 34. I love it how uh, Bulk Bogan, who has no no magic training, is still a fairly good magic man. Note to self, possibly consider switching him over to magic next. And again, I have no idea how career tracks properly work in this one. Actually, let's take a look at this. She's actually getting pretty close to uh, level 5 craftsman, so I could actually get her up to one of the tier 2 classes, which would be pretty cool. Might not be a bad idea to just uh, make 6 weapons and send them all out at the same time. Yeah, no, let's keep doing uh, vacations for a bit. I think vacations have actually made quite the difference in things. Okay, so this one's magic. Ooh. Yeah, so let's let's do dazzling. Exploration, actually, I think is going to be the, uh, the key, you know, selling time. Okay, and let's, let's actually forge another one, because we maxed somebody out last time. Let's just keep them all in the same spot. All right, Russet Peters, maybe you'll actually be worthwhile at this this time around. Eh, it's marginally better than last time. Okay. Of course, we're not going to be able to uh, throw an enchantment into it, so there's that, but you know what? Close enough. God, I love the little potato dog. So when do we get to level two? Probably after we finish this objective. Let's crank this time up. I'll just keep my hand on the clock. Or not the clock, the, uh, the time controls. There we go. Okay, and let's not enchant this one. Okay, so that's some basic stuff. Let's go sell. Here, we're going to be... Yep, so we're going to be selling the wands and the dagger. Select a smith. And Russet Peters, the no longer depressed merchant. Perfect. Okay, next up, lore craft. Send to world map. Explore here. There's still some resources she hasn't found yet. She's a pretty good explorer, too. Okay. Uh, research. Let's get a wand. Yeah, weirdly enough, bulk bogan. Unless, no, it's not keyed per stat. I have no idea. Might as well get the next one. Okay. Let's crank that time up. Okay, so we've got offers for... This is this is a wand, right? No, this is the dagger. Alright, let's sell it to him. Ooh, he's got a high max level. Okay, this is the first wand. At this point, I'm just making money. So we'll sell it to him. I thought there was a third one. Guess not? Either that or it bugged out. Oh, we... Oh, did I only sell it, send two items to sell? Nuts. Alright, fine. Not the end of the world. Let's... Sell weapons? Yeah, no, I must, must have forgotten to bring one along. Alright, let's take a look at the murky marshes. Maybe one of these guys will want the wand. Dagger wand, dagger axe. Let's see if we can sell both. Because we definitely want to get one rid of that bow, so I might as well send him off again. He's pretty fast anyway. Ah, uh, so we get some more ruby sapphires and stuff. Eh, let's just keep exploring. I've got, I've got a fair amount of cash. And, hey, that's the last item we were missing. We are missing a relic, though. Okay. And this will level, level her up for exploration. This is going to take a while for the research to be done.